Alright, how's it going people? Welcome back to another episode of Tales of Berseria. Again, I hope I'm pronouncing that right. We have still got to sell the pickleball meat. And then get some fucking medicine for our little bro bro sparklies. Hey girly. Hey, look at the doggy. Nico, here for groceries? Yep. And you must have been out hunting. Yeah, it was a good haul. Look at you, Lady Breadwinner. If you were a boy, I think I'd be in love. Good thing I'm a girl. You fucking lesbian. Oh, yeah? You ought to do something about your style, then. Uh, yeah. I kind of broke my comb. So get a new one. Oh, a comb. I need a comb. Sure, I'd like to, but... Hey, mister! How about a sale on combs for the pretty girl? <laughs> huh? Oh, you two need something? The I'm D. Fine, <laughs> I'm just here to pick up medicine for Lafayette. Oh, Velvet. I already told Arthur, but I'm afraid the medicine hasn't come in yet. You fucking slut. What? Why not? Is it because of the demons? Seems like the demon blight's really taking a toll on the city. There's even a group of them lurking around here now. When's it coming, then? I can't say. And I don't know how much it will cost. Oh, no. Ugh. What is wrong with Midgand? I mean, don't they have an army or something? Those guys? The demons already routed them a while back. But we're safe here, right? After all, your brother-in-law's an exorcist. You so sure about that? Arthur can't even use his right hand anymore. Too much masturbating. The fellow couldn't even protect his own wife and child. Ooh, shut the fuck up. Know when the medicine gets in. Uh, uh, of course. For now, here, on the house. Better be a fucking comb, asshole. <laughs> Velvet! You didn't forget, did you? You promised to teach me how to make your special key. You mean for that apprentice animal doctor you had your eye on? You were serious? Beyond serious! Please. This is life or death for me. But I Wait. thought your folks weren't keen on the two of you dating. Who cares what people think? The important thing is my feelings. <laughs> I like the way you talk. If I were a boy, I think I'd be in love. Fucking Don't lesbians write. everywhere. <laughs> Think I found the title for this video already. <laughs> must be starving by now. I better hurry home. Oh, sell me your wet. No, I don't want to speak to you. No, you want to make your special quiches, right? Yeah, but mine aren't nearly as good as hers. Don't be modest. They're fantastic. Simple yet elegant. That's because there's a secret in the cheese and the dough. You should try selling them in Taliesin. I'm sure they'd be a hit. We could make them together and take them on the road. <gasps> we could even wear matching uniforms. Would it make more money than hunting fricklebores? Definitely, maybe. Even more so if you could lighten up a bit in front of the customers. Then it might be worth a try. <laughs> I do want to buy Lofi a nice heavy winter coat. And Arthur's gloves are in tatters, so he needs new ones. Oh, don't be so boring. I get where you're coming from, but come on! Think big! Dream, Velvet! Dream! Think big? Hmm. I could do no, with thanks. a new dildo. I want a peaceful life with Luffy <laughs> and Arthur. That's all. You're impossible. Then again, maybe that's why your quiches taste so darn good. The secret is titty juice. Oh. There we go. Yeah. Ooh, got new stuff. Oh, I need to sell some stuff first. Sell them. Sell my comfrey. Or fragment. A stone containing a rare mineral collected by many despite a small value. Where's all of my prickle boo meat? God damn it, I wanted to buy the sword. It's, uh, ooh, hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. Hot, 
hot, hot, hot, nope, hot, heat, hot, there we go. Uh, well, I can't lose these, can I? So, yes, double gold, yes, double grayed, yes, half price enhancing, yes, added carry capacity, yes. Uh, Double out learning speed, yes. Ooh, okay, yep. You know what, fuck it, let's just get them all. Yep. Yep. Raises each party member. Oh yeah, these, these all carry over, don't they? Like in the first game, I think. All party members can gain five levels. Yes. 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 <laughs> oh, the grind is unbearable. <laughs> Fine, great. Should I increase match match people on 1,000? Yes. Hooray. Can we change it now? Oh, we can. Woo! Japan style. <laughs> a twin tail hairstyle to go with the clothing from the faraway land. I, oh, Jesus. Fairy tale style. And menagerie. Whoa. That's long as fuck. Oh, I am. Can we zoom in? Change animation. That's not changing animation, it's moving. Oh, 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 oh. oh, zooming in out. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Oh. There we go. Well, let's go with a really fucking long one for now. Japan stop. <laughs> Whoa. Holy crap. Okay. That's interesting. Uh, fairy tale. <laughs> Oh fuck, it's like Alice in Wonderland. What? A menagerie. Wow, fucking hell. This is what that looks like with the Japan style here. That's not too bad. Fuck it, let's go menagerie. Wow, look at all this shit. <laughs> oh my god! I've got a little. <laughs> oh look at my bow! Oh look at my fucking hat! Oh look at my little hat! Oh, I've got a clock on my back. What, what the fuck? <laughs> I I kind of like that. <laughs> oh, I wouldn't put it on. I wouldn't put it on. Uh, oh, we still have... Okay, let's see. Uh, shop. Pump. Sell. Peach. Oh, that's price. Okay. Fucking hell. Well, we'll sell one of those. That gives us uh, 300. Okay, buy. Tack plus five. Amber blade. Uh, equipment. Oh, even yes, nice, sweet. Yeah, look at me. All right, let's use all of these. Oh, fucking bash! Oh, fucking come on! Holy fuck. Alright, now we're like super fucking strong. Okay. Look at <laughs> Fucking hell. Alright, what are we doing? Return home, okay. I'm actually going to change that hair, it's kind of annoying me for some reason. Let's try that one. 
That's a bit better. Yeah. Yo, bro. Look at my shoes. Look at my titties. <laughs> What's up, Papi? Hi, Mama. Hi, Celica. I'm back. I can't believe it's been seven years since we lost you. And the baby you carried. Oh, drat. I forgot to bring your princessias. I know how much you, Mom, and Dad all loved those flowers. And I know your child would have too. I'm sorry. I'll pick some from the Cape tomorrow. I told you to stay in bed. That you little shit. A little. Look, your fever hasn't gone down a bit. Go lie down and I'll cook dinner. I'm sorry. What's Looks like this? my hair is nursing a semi. A compass. It uses a magnet to tell you which way you're facing. Woohoo. You can use the sun and stars for that. And what'll you do if it's cloudy, huh? Thanks to this invention, we'll even be able to voyage across the ocean. See? It's designed to stay level, so your heading will be true even when the ship is rolling with the waves. Pretty neat, right? If you say so, Luffy. Come on, it's a must-have for any adventure. Can't you see how useful it is? You can tell me more about it later. I don't care about your shit. I got pretty dress. Did they hurt you? Not a scratch. And I brought back plenty. I can hear Arthur already. Gosh, Velvet. I think it's time you learned all my secret arts. He isn't coming home tonight, is he? How do you know that? Sarah stopped by and told me. Arthur's Moloch? Huh. You really can talk to Malachim, can't you? Yeah. Arthur says I've got exorcist potential. No kidding. I think you'll be an exorcist to rival even him. I can tell you've been learning all sorts of things from his book collection. I really want to become an exorcist. I want to go traveling with you and see all the wonders of the world. I'll hunt and chop firewood, and if demons come for us, I'll defend you. I wish... I wish I could do that. <sighs> but you can't because you're a pussy. You'll get there, Laffy said. It should only take... Oh, about 20 years. Oh, 20 years tops. <laughs> <laughs> it won't take me that long. Oh yeah. <laughs> Prove it to me then. Oh, I fucking called it so Stop hard. With this lovely meatball stew. I <laughs> Eat every last mouthful, even if you don't feel hungry. Oh, that's made my fucking day. Medicine, that. No matter how nasty it tastes. No tricks. Am I oh. clear? Yes, ma'am. You stay in bed, or you'll get a fucking slap across the face. You're cooked. Right. Cooking time. First, I need to light the stove. First, I'm going to change my equipment once again. Sorry, guys. I really don't like that. <laughs> Let's go with that. Yeah. Ooh. Jiggle figure. Jiggle for that. Jiggle physics. There you go. <laughs> Boing. Boing. Okay. Yeah, let's, let's cook your meal. And remember, the secret is titty juice. What's up here? Is it magic? Oh, it's just fucking sparkly. Oh. Rock salt. I put rock salt in your food. Okay, let's climb. Oh, no. Oh, I broke my legs. The day Check. before Scarlet Night, Sis went prickle boar hunting on her own. She's almost as good a fighter as Arthur. So I know those prickle boars don't stand a chance. But I worry that she's too athletic to land a husband. Maybe she should be <laughs> more ladylike. 
little scamp. He just knew I'd be reading this, didn't he? I'm too athletic to find a husband. <laughs> Observations of the nameless Empyrean. Isn't this Arthur's book? Is Loffy really reading stuff this dense? <laughs> Poor kid's gonna squint his eyes right out. Oh, racist. Ignite. <laughs> it's so easy to light Arthur's firewood. I wonder what his trick is. Um, velvet? He's he sucks it in gasoline. Could you not put any spinach in the stew? Huh. You'll never grow up if you're picky with your food, you know. Mm, I know, but but just for today? <laughs> fine, fine. I'll leave out the spinach just this once. And I'll make it that curry flavor you like. Really? Thanks, Velvet. Oh, sparkly eyes. <laughs> There's some of Arthur's special curry spice upstairs, isn't there? Oh, Arthur's special curry spice. Why does it say aphrodisiac on it? <laughs> there you go. Not spicy hot, but oh so delicious. Sure. Oh yeah, I saw Nico today, and she had very important things to talk about. She's coming over in the next couple days, so be on your best behavior. I will. I'm glad you've got a good friend. Yeah, we've known each other since forever. Still... Nico falling in love? I can barely wrap my head around it. Laffy, you know, if there's a girl you like, you'll tell Big Sister all about it, right? A g girl Hmm. Then I can You're tell the girl you got a small brat, penis. So you might need an older girl to keep you under control. Oh, jeez. Oh, and she's got to be a good cook. A pro in the kitchen is a success at life. Knock it off, Velvet! You should be more worried about your own love life. Me? I I've got enough on my mind. For one thing, I've got to cook for you and Arthur since Salika is gone. Besides, getting crushes on strange men? I just don't see what's so... <coughs> Lovely, <laughs> what's wrong? Too much talk of the D is making him sick. <laughs> What's up, bro? Are you alright? I'll bring you some water. I'm fine. You just said something funny is all. And it made me choke a bit. <sighs> as long as you're okay. Sorry, I went off on a Oh, day he's day. choking on the talk of the D. <laughs> Who knows what the future holds? Yeah, but what more can I do? I've got a duty to look after my little brother. And I'm serious about it. I know. But I'm trying to look after you, too. I want you to be happy. That's all. And it's not just me. Arthur worries about you too. Well, we're family, right? Yeah. That's what families do. Thanks, Laffy. For you, I'd kill every last prickle boar in the forest if it came down to it. <sighs> oh, what am I doing? I need to hurry and get dinner ready. Yeah, I need to get your supper. Begin cooking. I cooked the shit out of it. It tastes like shit, sis. Thanks. Get your fucking ass in bed, you twat. Good boy. You didn't forget your medicine. Well, I did promise. Tomorrow's a scarlet night. Yeah, just like that night that changed our lives. Um, Velvet, may I sleep next to you tonight? You dirty fucker. <laughs> of course. You just want to grab a little of these. Fucking pervert. Celebration birthday cake music. <sighs> okay, let's see. Today, I've got to dry some meat and use that cheese I've been saving to make a quiche for... 
Luffy? Oh, he's gone like an asshole. You little... Where have you gone? You Get... better not have gone to the village alone. Uh, I bet your fever hasn't even gone down. God, I'm gonna fucking slap the shit out of that kid. Uh, fuck it. Uh... Oh, there's a man sightseeing with his doggy. Where the fuck is he? Search for Laffy. Oh, Laffy, Laffy, Lulu. You got sparklies? Oh, give me some sparklies. You want some sparklies? Oh, you fucking asshole, you fucking cheap motherfuckers. Hey, has Laffy set been here? Uh, no. I haven't seen him. Wait, that's one of Arthur's. Actually, it's a copy that Lafayette made. <sighs> a smart merchant would pay a pretty penny for this book. I gave him a fair trade. Luffy, did he really copy all that by hand? Oh, he must have done it to buy that compass. No, though he gave it some puppy eyes. Told him I'd throw it in for free, but he said that it would be a bad deal for me. He's a good lad, but not the merchant type. So, what did he use the money for? I'm afraid my lips are sealed. You'll have to ask him. Oh, not the anal beads again. Velvet, I saw Lafayette walking around. Is he okay? He's not okay. Where'd you see him? He was headed for the forest. I'll help you look for him. Thanks. Do a sweep of the village, just in case. I'll check the forest. With my titties. God damn it, you stupid, stupid son of a bitch. I know. He might have gone to the Cape to pick flowers. You know flowers will kill you. Jesus. Where the fuck did you go? Autumn coloured forest. Oh, hang on. Fucking sparklies again. They come back quick. Holy fuck. <laughs> oh yeah, of course, we fucking... Ooh. Holy shit, man. We've just learnt seven arts, just like that. Of oh, fucking hell. Of course, yeah, because we used all the levelling up fucking stuff. Um, well, wow, shit, man. Okay. Right. Um. Holy fuck. Oh my god. That's <laughs> So fucking many! Okay, so... All of that up to there is uh, martial arts and these are hidden arts. Okay, so let, for the first two, let's worry about uh, martial arts. Let's do... Uh, let's do gouging spin, that's good against crustacean. Uh, swallow dance, that's good against winged. Amorphous, Twin Whip, okay, Demi-Human, let's do that, uh, Water Snake's Wake, Avalanche Fang, D uh, I haven't done that Avo, Moonlight Cyclone, good against Beast, Soaring Dragon, good against Dragon, Rising Moon. Heaven's Wrath, good against Undead. Let's do that. How many more hiddens of... Okay, we're right at the edge. 
Okay, so we got Searing Edge. Let's pop that back on there. Ah, uh, Searing Edge. Mega Sonic Thrust, good against Armoured. Shell Splitter, good against Crustacean. Shadow Flow against Amorphous. Slag Assault. <laughs> Fucking hell. A hidden art that splits the earth with a shockwave thrust limits the movement of Apodus Daemons. Banishing Thunder, Binding Frost. Scale Crusher, Defiant Conviction. Jesus. Okay, but yeah, we're on the last last bits now, so... Uh, sla oh yeah, Slag Assault. Good against person, let's pop that there. Scale Crusher, good against Dragon. Binding Frost. So, oh, let's put Cerberus Wave and... Uh, Whereas well, between these three, so Banishing Thunder, Binding Frost and Scale Crusher. That uses, what's that, Water and Fire. That one is Earth and Water. And water and air. A merciless lightning fast ass attack that serves the bonds that, that tie undead to this world. Severs the bonds, sorry. A hidden art that creates icy shards. Cold enough to chill a fiend that seek out, snare and pull in an enemy. Creates orbs of pure cold and fierce heat in succession. Generating the temperature shock powerful enough to shatter even drinks. Let's fucking put that on. Wow. Okay. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, what are you doing, little little fucking kitty? Velvet, can you walk? How's your fever? I'm fine. I was just taking a break. Oh, you little. You know better than this, Lafayette. Said, running off without telling me. What if something happened to you? You wouldn't be the only one hurt. Do you understand that? I'm sorry. If you want to do something, just ask. I know I'm a crummy big sister, and I can't afford to buy you all the things you want. No, that's not why I went out. You see, it was just... I get it. You're right. I forgot the flowers for the graves. Yeah, so I was going out to the Cape, and I thought... You want to see the ocean too, don't you? Well, yeah, that too. Fine. Just for today, though. Are you sure? I am. But next time you run off like that, I'm strapping you to your bed. Yes, ma'am. Naughty Good. style. It's off to the Cape, then. Hooray!